The Amazing Race is celebrating their 10th anniversary by bringing in some big-time talent. This year we actually have a number of teams who have competed at a very high level. People are going to expect, oh, like, you're one survivor, so you should be able to win every show you've ever been on. Olympic snowboarders. When it's time to get serious, we're, we're going to get serious. We know when to lay down the hammer. Drive just comes out of naturally. You can't get where we've been in snowboarding without your determination. A former NFL star. I think one of the things that I have to acquire over my football career is figuring out strategy, what I can do best, what, what I'm better than somebody else at, and do it better than they can do it. And a sailing whiz kid. When I was 16 years old, I set off on a 13-month adventure around the world. I uh, set two records, youngest person to sail around the world and first person under 18 to ever sail around the world. Oh, we live, breathe adventure 24 hours a day, seven days a week. It's uh, what I try and go for all the time. Some of them are a little, you know, like, we know all about competing. We're going to be fine. Don't worry about us. Then when they get out there, they find out that the amazing race is like no other race. Which means there's hope for the other teams who are regular Joes. We are big people in tiny people packages, I guess. We're not the most muscular or anything like that, but I think that we're a lot of fun and it comes across, I mean, everything that we do. She's psychotic <laughs> and I'm, I'm, I'm easy going. I'm not psychotic. I think we're chosen because we are clearly opposite. So I'm very organized, very prepared, very linear. He's a little bit more... Um, free-spirited. Free-spirited, kind of does what he likes to do, takes more risks. Well, we've wanted to be on the show for, for a long time. Um, Ten years, for the, since 2001. Since it started, we would sit there and play the game, of course, from our living room. and uh, With a glass of wine. And, <laughs> and we always came in first place. We worked at a lot of nightclubs in Las Vegas, so every night is like a different, different crazy, crazy person <laughs> that we're dealing with. I mean, we could tell you all kinds of stuff about people we're not supposed to talk about. But <laughs> <laughs> We don't know one another in uh, intense situations, so I just know him kind of nights and weekends kind of a thing so it's going to be interesting i always you know give the analogy i'm going to learn in 30 days what i would learn probably in the next two or three years uh, we're in pretty good shape but we're also over 60 years old so whether we want to or not we're going to be kind of a mother father figure we're 23 we just graduated college so i think like a younger age group is going to identify with us like we're going through a quarter life crisis we don't have jobs we're looking but there's <laughs> nothing out there let's be hiring? honest for survivor winner ethan zahn this race will be the ultimate test of his successful two-year battle against cancer. We wanted to you know, do something together, and The Amazing Race is a wonderful opportunity, and after everything that we have been through as a couple and individually with you know, Ethan's cancer diagnosis, it's kind of an amazing opportunity for us to really be with each other. And this season, new adventures.